Hi everyone, Troy Sage here, and today on Real Estate Talk, or this episode of Real Estate Talk, Chris Peterson from Renovate America and the Hero Program. Thank you for being here. Thanks for having me. Um, I truly do appreciate it. This is our fourth and final episode. So what I'd like to uh, kind of touch on right now is a uh, homeowner has a home with the HERO program. Uh, some agents out there are not familiar with the HERO program. They are all freaked out about the situation. And instead of uh, getting educated, which some have and some haven't, they kind of run in circles and say, oh, they tell buyers, don't buy that home, the HERO's on there. Or they tell sellers, I can't ever sell, sell your home. Mm -hmm. So explain to us what you're doing now or what your company's doing and how you're really ramping it up for everyone. That's great. Uh, and you know, this is really what my group uh, does. I have a great team who focuses on just this issue, uh, Troy. What we do is our, it's called our MLS outreach process. So whenever a property comes up on the market that has a hero assessment that's actively listed, we start with an email and we explain who we are, what we're trying to do. It's a free service. Uh, we're trying to help the homeowners and the listing agents understand, A, do you remember there's a hero assessment? Not all homeowners remember that they did right. that two or three, four years ago. Um, and give them the resource, the phone number to call. We offer our transaction guide, which has great collateral that can help you uh, with marketing and sale of the property. Uh, so we email the homeowner and the listing agent. If we don't hear from you, we're gonna give you a call. We're gonna bug you till you, till you, till you call us back or, or answer your phone. Um, when the property is pending, we do the same thing, just to make sure a lot of times we don't get you on the first go around, or as you know, Troy, you, your properties are on the market an average of what, two or three days. Sometimes, so yeah. some, sometimes you know, the process hasn't quite hit then, so we're getting it pending, but at some point you're gonna hear from us so that we can help you to understand uh, what it is that you're dealing with and how to best navigate this through escrow. That's awesome. So there's, in these four episodes, we've talked about a lot. We've talked about how you're now uh, reaching out to the homeowner prior to funding the money so they understand mm -hmm. exactly what the process is, what they've signed, what they're getting in return. Mm -hmm. uh, we've talked about the, uh, the fact that the uh, property, the, the tax assessment will uh, transfer over in some situations and won't in others. That's correct. And we've talked about just honestly that this program is for a lot of people but maybe not for everyone. Very true. So. Uh, for those of you that are watching this, and I do appreciate you watching all of our real estate talk episodes, but especially this hero program, which we've had a ton of hits on, because you know I've I've been on YouTube for a while talking about you guys. Some mm -hmm. stuff good, some stuff not so good, and the not so good stuff is really old. Mm -hmm. So um, I want the the viewers to be educated on this. This is why we have Chris here, and I can't tell you how much I appreciate you coming out here for this. Sure, I'd also like to mention, if I could, we actually have a team that also will go out to your brokerage or to the association, and we'll do educational workshops. It's called Hero in a Transaction. It's not as much about promoting the program as it's about promoting education to real estate professionals on how to work with Hero in a Transaction, which is full of great information, and there's a webinar series coming soon, which you'll be able to access on demand. So these are the resources that we're providing to the real estate community all in an effort for open lines of communication, for transparency, and to make sure that our customers in the community, the real estate community itself, is covered in these types of situations. That's awesome. So you guys have really raised the bar, in my opinion. Thank you. So I'm going to be opinionated here, which I am all the time, but you guys have raised the bar. You guys are, are doing things like, like clockwork now. You, you guys have, have top-notch contractors that use your financing. Mm -hmm. You guys are uh, really keeping your thumb on the pulse of this. So I thank you so much for being here. I'd love to do more series with you as things progress in our industry. Let's keep people involved. Chris, thank you again so much for being thank here. Thank you so much for having me. This is Troy Sage with Real Estate Talk. Thanks for watching our videos. And as always, make it a great day.